Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to St. Mary's Perivale. Uh, particularly if you've not bit watched our concerts before, uh, you're delighted to have you here. We have a lot of concerts, and mainly classical. Uh, we have three a week, but every month we have a jazz concert as well to give a bit of variety, much needed variety, and today is our jazz piano afternoon, and I'm delighted to welcome Liam Noble, who's a highly regarded jazz pianist, coming to play us some lovely tunes and give us a, an enjoyable hour of jazz piano. He's going to introduce his repertoire, and I'm going to get off the stage and give a warm welcome to Liam. Thank you very much. Hello, everybody. Thank you for coming. It's a shame you can't be in here because it's a lovely building. Um, yes, I'm going to do a few different tunes today. I'm going to start with a tune that I discovered, I suppose, in my early teens and rediscovered recently whilst investigating repertoire for my series of online concerts that I've been doing from home. Um, so this is a tune by the Eurythmics called Sweet Dreams.
Thank you. Uh, yes, correct. <laughs> it's been a while since I've held a microphone, as you can well imagine. Um, so that was uh, two tunes. Sweet Dreams Are Made Of This by the Arrhythmics and a tune of mine called Rain On My Birthday. Um, this was written um, about a story my wife told me when she was young. We haven't decided how young she was when this happened. And uh, it was her birthday and it was raining and she apparently shaked, shaked? Shook. She apparently shook her fists at the rain clouds in anger and frustration. So it's called Rain on My Birthday, that tune. Um, the next tune I'm going to do is uh, called Traumare. And it, I don't know if I pronounced that right. It's by Robert Schumann. Um, I've been delving a little bit into some classical repertoire and trying to make it jazzy without actually playing a lot of jazz stuff on it. So kind of improvising with the themes. Um, and it's one of the things I've been doing on my online concerts, um, mainly because I, I've found that there's a certain audio, I've looked at who comes to the gigs and thought, what do they want to hear? So there's quite a lot of 80s pop music for people my age. <laughs> and then there are quite a lot of people that have suggested tunes, among them a lot of classical repertoire. So uh, this was one that I kind of liked because it has the feeling of a kind of jazz standard to me. Um, so this is Traumarai.
Thank you. Um, I'm going to do a Duke Ellington tune now called uh, Sunset and the Mockingbird. And um, I don't know what an actual mockingbird sounds like, but there's something in this melody that sounds like it could be a mockingbird. So I'm going to assume that that's what it is. Sunset and the Mockingbird by Duke Ellington.
Thank you. I keep standing up. I'm not sure if that's the right thing to do. <laughs> if I sit down, can you see me? Um, that was uh, tuned by jazz pianist Bud Powell called Hallucinations. And I think in his case, in the most serious sense possible, he was writing from personal experience. Um, the next tune was um, very popular with a band who may also have had hallucinations of their own at some point. I mean, it was the 80s. Um, this is a tune called Save a Prayer um, by Duran Duran. It's only just occurred to me that I'm in a church doing this tune, so it feels a bit strange, but anyway. Duran Duran, Save a Prayer. This was another one that I um, investigated for one of my online gigs, and um, I realized that actually it had, the structure of it has quite a lot in common with certain elements of classical music. Um, so it became quite an interesting thing to play and something that I thought I would keep in my set. So here it is, Save a Prayer.
Thank you. I'm going to save a prayer by Duran Duran. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to finish with two pieces together, both of which I recorded on an album called A Room Somewhere uh, in 2014. Uh, at that point, I didn't actually know that everybody would be in a room somewhere, mostly on their own. Uh, anyway, these are two, two tunes. One is by Paul Simon. Uh, I used to listen to this record a lot when I was a kid. So my, my parents had it, uh, an album called There Goes Rhyming Simon. And this is a tune called uh, Tenderness. And it's followed by... Um, a tune from My Fair Lady called Wouldn't It Be Lovely and that's where I got the title for the album All I Want Is A Room Somewhere so uh, I'd just like to thank now before I start the last bit um, thank everybody here at St Mary's Church for having me it's a really fantastic place um, it's kind of sad looking at all these empty seats, but on the other hand, I'm quite, I feel quite kind of encouraged that pretty soon there'll be some people in them again, hopefully. So lots and lots of thanks to all the people that have put this gig on. And um, I would like to thank everybody for coming as well. Um, it's really quite amazing how this kind of technology with streaming and everything has kept the music scene alive. So I think we should all be very thankful for that. So with that, I'm going to do Tenderness by Paul Simon and Wouldn't It Be Lovely by Lerner and Lowe from My Fair Lady. Thank you for coming.
Well, thank you all for watching and thank you, Liam, for a most enjoyable afternoon of uh, varied tunes, uh, uh, life-enhancing, cool music, most enjoyable. And I apologize for the internet playing up this afternoon. It's beyond our control. Uh, this happens in about one in ten concerts and there's not much we can do about it. Later in the year, we'll have a fiber connection to the church uh, and it'll put pay to all those problems. Uh, we'll be uploading a high uh, definition uh, version of Liam's excellent recital immediately after the uh, recital. So it'll be available about seven o'clock this evening. Uh, but thank you, Liam. It was very refreshing to have a bit of jazz. Now, uh, we're back to more familiar fare tomorrow because we have the Tippet String Quartet playing two great masterpieces of the chamber music repertoire. The first Razumovsky Quartet by Beethoven, Opus 59, number one, and Schubert's Death and the Maiden Quartet, two of the greats. That's tomorrow afternoon at four. I uh, had a busy week. It's been terrific. And I um, uh, had a great afternoon this afternoon and I uh, hope you can join us tomorrow. Thank you, and of course, uh, sorry to repeat the old uh, message, but if you've enjoyed it, please donate via our PayPal facility. Uh, part of the purpose of these concerts is to provide financial support for musicians in a very difficult time, and we've kept going because of your generosity. Hope you can keep it going, because we may have few more months to go. And if you can donate via our PayPal facility, it will make ends meet. And I'll be very grateful. It all goes to the musicians, not to us. We're all unpaid volunteers. Uh, so, thank you very much for being with us. And a good afternoon to you. <laughs>